Today, the Veteran Affairs Office of the Inspector General was at the Chico VA Clinic to investigate after a patient was involved, or maybe more than one involved in a violent incident involving family. This was in 2022. Now, Action News Now reporter Camille Acevedo is live in front of the clinic near Bruce Road. Camille, what was the OIG looking into? For one thing, they wanted to find out if the clinic failed to provide same day access as well as mental health assessments for that patient that you're talking about, Linda. The Veteran Affairs Office of Inspector General report says that staff didn't grasp the urgency of the help that patient needed. The report says there was not a care provider available that day to evaluate the patient. They were too booked up, but the Veterans Health Administration requires facilities to provide patients with same day appointments if there is an urgent need for it. That didn't happen here. Today, U.S. Secretary of Veteran Affairs Dennis McDonough was here for a meeting and I asked him what happens next. So this is an important opportunity for us to learn uh, really important lessons. Uh, and part of my learning today was to come up here to meet with our team to hear directly from them what their experience is right now, what I need to uh, do to make sure that I'm the best possible partner for them. Uh, and uh, in that regard, this was a very, very helpful. And coming up at five, you will hear from veterans who share their own experience coming here to the Chico VA clinic. Live in Chico, I'm Camille Acevedo for Action News Now, coverage you can count on. All right, thank you, Camille, for that report. Of course, we're going to continue following this case closely.